Right after that little rendezvous at Hayden Park, Southmade wanted to show us his actual block, so we headed to the opposite corner of the Hayden Park area, more specifically the northwest corner of Broadway and 7th Ave, aka 9th Ave and Pueblo. There, we linked up with some more homies, and they gave me a little rundown and a few key points to know about this corner of Broadway and 7th Ave. When I got there, I was having technicals with my mic, so we missed a little audio, but in a nutshell, this section of the hood was just a tad more diverse than the actual Hayden Park area. With his block and the next couple of blocks north being Hispanic dominant and the handful of blocks north of those blocks being black dominant. Also, there's a handful of little cliques in that area currently duking it out for control and influence. And after that little briefing, we headed over to the Little Hood Park where he told a little fictional story of a business transaction gone bad. So like I was saying, I know when you buy the Get licked, then I know how to like you know post that shit up. So I knew all the signs, all the red flags. We was calling it out to our homie. We was like, hey, this is this and that. It's about to be this and this and that. Came here and shit uh, to link up. Matt, come here. My boy was doing a blunt in the back seat. I'm minding my business. Hold on, just. Hold on. I heard this nigga telling the other nigga, I don't feel right. Something weird. Turns out he was dedicated to make this self. Boom. So I'm like sitting in the car, right? I'm my shit like this. He like reached over, uh, try to he literally put my hand on my shit. I like, mm, hit that boy like that and try to put my shit out. But he came with his partner though. So boom, both them niggas, like, like just up shit. The homie in the passenger seat just like pushing it out. He kind of like fell. And um, I just got up on it and then the, that's when they let off shots and horrible. However many, he said he picked up like shells. They busted the back windshield, like it was crazy. Like, anyway, we had to come out like, I got hungry, hungry, and then he like that. 556, 545. All tips. It's not just inside the clip. It's one up top. Always. Ancient. You know, every day. His dad. Got five down to us. We have stripes. Shut the up. But that's besides the point. Like, look, are you learning? Like, it's not. Walk with me. This is like not about earning stripes. Like all the little youngins, bro, so eager to uh, earn a stripe for what, bro? Like for what? Like for what? Half the time niggas telling anyways. Like you gonna do a bid? With your boy? He rats on you? Then what? Okay, and then if he does keep it solid, then what? Y'all got a little bit less years. Shit, all about. Making money now. So yeah, wait. So you we'll go to nineteen next. Next, about to go to the motherfucking crack spot. Um, <laughs> yes, sir. And uh, Southern right here. Get a bottle. <laughs> yeah, the and then walk the block, talk to some crackheads. Hey, right, what? <laughs> Draco. <laughs> uh -uh, what? That's just going through your shit. From ninth Ave, Puebla. Eight hundred block. It goes ninth Ave right here. Then at the end of that street, 7th Ave. I live more towards 7th Ave than he lives right here, more close to 9th Ave. We were still together every time. Quite well, and primarily Hispanic block. Yeah, but you know, it's our love. Like we ain't even like that was, like all that like beefy and segregation. It was, it was, it was like, like it's our love now. Like to be honest. I'm coming. I'm coming. I like you, Channel yourself. How's it? Say what's up? Dr. Sasson. Hello, hello, how you doing? Alright, say what's up to the camera. It was just me and Damien. This is my f***ing old shot, nigga. What's up, mama? Oh, get 140 hours. You see ATL? Yeah. Hey, I don't know what the f*** you saying. You want the good? I got the bad. I got the egg. You motherfucker. Hey, come on, y'all. Ladies, say, say. You see how he looked, right? You see. Everybody's seen his eye, right? Bro, with the AK. 762. AK. Went in, hit his eye, went out, lived. So supposedly, like, they didn't have, like, enough velocity, didn't get up there because it was such a close shot. But they do now. You know what I'm talking about? It was such a close shot, he couldn't really, like, the bullet can he pick up speed. Up. Thug, though. Yeah, though. Nigga scrapped the one hand before. Seen it. 
Thugger. <laughs> Alright, next up. Hi, the spot we're gonna be at tonight. And by hot, I mean the Ops is out. The Ops is out. For the next stop on the tour of the South with South Made, we hit what is allegedly a staple on the South Side as far as the liquor and convenience stores go. Now, like I said earlier, the South is a wild ass place, okay? You know how they used to call this part of the country the Wild West? The South Side is always a reminder of why. The only part of the city where it's normal to walk in the store and buy a bottle of Henny with an AK hanging out of your pants. Nobody even bats an eye or even thinks twice about it. Upon arrival though, we were quickly reminded that we were in the 9, aka the Lindo Park area. Hey, that's that documentary shit? Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, bro. Hey, y'all on the 9! <laughs> That's a hood tour for another time, but in case y'all aren't hip to those guys, they don't fuck around and are definitely no joke. Hey, what are you doing? What's up, sir? What's up? I got cash. They brought you to the to the to the 19 store, huh? Right, right. I know, I know. This is yeah, this Lindo. Too, yeah. Too. <laughs> right on. Well, I can't wait till you come and holler at us, man. Uh, yeah, man, I'm ready whenever. I'm trying to see who wants to orchestrate it more. So, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Yeah. Shit, well, I'll be there. Okay. You know what I mean? Cool. All right, bro. Y'all be good, okay? Yeah. Drop safe, man. Maybe some hoes out here. Too. <laughs> It's yeah, activation. It's yeah. and honestly, it's not even like it's this not. Nothing. It's not real quick. It's like it's crazy though. This guy gets spicy, fucking hoes trying to get in your car and shit. This nigga ended up getting shot over here. Shot at over oh. here. This me. Tada. Oh yeah, actually, I was inside with the homie and I had two homies in the back seat. The okay, hey. Two homies were all parked up over here, and me and another homie were getting some drinks up inside of the store and. And soon we just hear shots going off, pop, 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 at least five. Then you hear somebody else bucking from another side. You hear another like six shots, and then somebody else starts shooting from like the from the pumps. Oh, and you just everybody inside starts ducking. You ain't hear the Mexican running. dude. He said, "What you got? Four, five? Everybody no, running, net, no dog. Seven, six, okay, some dude right. come running inside saying, "What's going on? My arm leaking. My arm oh, about to fall out. out. He's leaking through his arm. He's all like, he's all about to fall. Shit." Man, that shit was crazy, and then he was all yelling about, I think I know who it was, this is Goofy Y. Yeah, nah, just the wrong place at the wrong time. This is how it be out here on the south side. We're gonna go to South Plaza. That shit right there we about to go? It's the heart of the soul. It's the heart of the soul, heart of the soul and you'll see why. And I got, I know the history on that shit. Long live my brother, dog. Get this shirt, long live my brother. What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? We over here in the South Plaza. Very friendly neighborhood. What's up, big dog? That nigga going through it. So this is like the neutral territory where all kind of hoods meet up, right? Uh, 100%. Especially on Sundays. These Sundays at South Plaza that South made are referring to are when all the low rider and car clubs come and rendezvous and get together on a very peaceful tip. But aside from those meets, if you grew up on the South Side, then you know South Plaza is a legendary plaza as far as South Side culture goes. For South Made, it also happens to be where he saw his first dead body. Anybody want ID you on the South? You got some Drake in your pants. I see somebody die right here. Oh yeah, there, uh, there was an overdose. I was probably like 13 right here. Right here? In this exact spot. In this exact spot. Like, he was like tweaking on the floor. Like, he was like having a seizure. And I was young as <laughs> just like watching this man just tweak. Like, he was like having really dying. Like, he was like, <laughs> mouth was going all crazy, foaming up on some. Like, some. I don't know how overdose, but I was just tripping and shit. Put that nigga on the stretcher. Sent that nigga out, and I ain't seen that since. But, but I don't know why the f this shit just came over. I used to come here all the f time. Like the yeah, sign is yeah, still yeah. up, like literally. Yeah. So there's a big car problem in there, or it's not as bad near the subpart. Hell yeah, I'm so far. Uh, shit. When we were on the way to uh, the liquor store, 19th and shit. I was seeing uh, I seen my f shooting up, and I was gonna go talk to him. They was like, and I don't f this thing, so I ain't even f with it. But, huh? Mad pill problem over here? Oh, f yeah. So way more, way bigger than crack and stuff. 
Yeah, yeah, I think all that. I don't know. That purse just. I don't know, that's crazy how that shit just shot. Then little blue pills taking over everything. Long live my brother. Any nigga yeah. talking down could get the smoke too. That this that's Ziggy right there. Ziggy. His ass would have been right here too. His big body ass. That's the South for you. It's happening with South May. South May hunting everywhere. IG, YouTube, just drop some shit. Call be honest. I'm gonna drop some more shit. And yeah, some more shit. Watch that shit. I'll be here for you. I'll be there for you. Oh <laughs> god. Hey baby, say baby, it is I, the biggest cactus of all time. And first and foremost, if you made it to the end of the tour, give yourself a big old pat on the back, okay? You're one of the realest to ever do it. Secondly, shout out my man South Made and Co., okay? They didn't have to take us behind the scenes and show us those Southside landmarks, but they did, all right? So shout out to those guys for taking time out of their day. Hayden Park is indeed a legendary section, okay? And a legendary Hispanic Phoenix hood, all right? And that's what we're doing, okay? We're showing you guys the culture firsthand behind the music, okay? Since y'all out of towner love to swear that arizona is nothing but tumbleweeds cactus and dust and whatnot okay now we gotta take you guys hood by hood block by block to show you guys otherwise okay if you need some studio time you know what to do slide in the dm at valley club records on ig okay you need a music video slide in the dm at court capital okay that's what we do best all right and if you rock with everything valley culture everything desert culture okay you also know what to do all right valleyclub.bigcartel.com grab you a piece of the rest of the motherfucking summer drop okay we're almost sold out no more larges no more mediums okay and by the time you're seeing this hoodies are probably available as well okay so grab you a fresh hoodie all right very limited very exclusive all right appreciate y'all tuning in to each and every hood tour and whatnot whether you love it hate it talk it learn from it whatever whatever it is you're doing okay appreciate it all right it's me big c's the biggest cactus of all time aka big Camera Lord, all right, love y'all. Valley Club, the cult.